Today, I'm going squishmallow hunting, and I find some squish that I've never seen before. Up first, we went to Claire's, and surprisingly, they did restock. They had a lot of these sea cows, Mondi, Alita, and then you have Kona. And I've never seen any of these in person, and I didn't even know Claire's was getting them. So definitely a really, really random find, but super cool. They also had a small section of accessories and miscellaneous squish products, like these nails, a mystery bag, and this lone little mini Benny notebook, which is super cute, just a little bit too expensive considering how small it is. Next up, we went over to TJ Maxx, and they had this little peacock stackable. Super, super cute. My mom loved the ombre colored rainbow. They also had Irving, and he is super, super cute. I already have him in a clip size, but he still was tempting to get. Then they had some miscellaneous ones, like from the Sea Squad. They had this rainbow narwhal. And here's everyone who they're supposed to have in that squad. But all they had in that one was that one and this seashell. There also was this rainbow unicorn, but you guys already know those really aren't for me. So we didn't get anything here, and we were off to another store, which was Marshall's. Going back there, I was totally surprised. I saw a bunch of squish that I've never seen before. Like, I'm not even sure what kind of squish she's supposed to be, but she looks super, super adorable. They also had this purple claw machine with a little heart as one of the gumballs. Never seen that before. And this Hans that said hugs and squishes. How cute. And these were Valentine Squish, and it's like Easter, so that's kind of crazy. Let me know if your stores are that behind on Seasonal Squish. They had a bunch of knockoffs as well, but of course we're not looking for those. And then there was this Lone Llama Alpaca. Miley, super, super cute, but just not for us. But she did have this super cool rainbow fuzzy belly. Then my mom showed me this squished imposter. She thought it was totally real, but come on, it wasn't. And this is her attempt at making that face on it. Uh, yeah, I gave her an A for effort. But we ended up not getting either of these squished, even though we haven't seen them before. They just really weren't going to fit in my collection well. So after here, we decided to hit up a local Kroger affiliate, Harris Teeter, since it was right across the street. Going back there, I could just see them, and they were in some type of, like, squish jail. Like, I felt really bad, like, they were trapped in there. And then on the other side, there was a bin of squish I've never seen before. This huge, huge squad of 16 inches. Like, look at this Neapolitan ice cream sandwich, Neely. And she was a rare squish. I definitely was super tempted by her. And then there was this apple juice. Again, so, so cute Jean was. But honestly, in a smaller size, I would definitely have picked it up. Both Jean and Neely. Then they had just some random ones. So they had some Sea Life Squad, like this Hammerhead Shark. They had this yellow frog with brown spots on the back. Super cute if you're into collecting the frogs. They also had this big neutral dog, which I've already seen at Walgreens. And they had this big fruit, which I'm assuming a cherry, because the name is literally Cherry. And she was super, super soft, and she had a fuzzy white belly. And then another random one in this squad was an alien squish with a beanie on. Daxon. And yeah, just a whole bunch of random members in this squad, to be honest with y'all. And here goes one that I think was a Costco squish at some point, Maui with those goggles on. And then over in the little bin of hostages, they had some random assortment of squish, like this sea bunny. I think that's what y'all told me it was. And they had this cute little tie-dye hermit crab. I absolutely love the colors on Trilly. And behind Trilly was this purple hippo, and my mom loves that texture on the stomach. And then we noticed this other big one that I haven't seen before. I think it's just an orange or maybe like a peach, 
but look how cool that tag is it says special edition but i'm not sure what makes it special edition so let me know if y'all know but that holographic bio tag was super super cool they definitely had a lot of unexpected squish here but honestly nothing for us so we left empty handed and off to our last stop of the day which was claire's number two in town they had a whole bunch of sea life squad again and the happy birthday squad of all squads definitely a super random one to see they had literally no sea cows here at all though so that's really really interesting to mention in their squish accessory area they had these little scrunchies winston fifi and cam definitely super super cute and here is the price if y'all wanted to know they also had this winston the owl book bag as well as a lone sonic squish we didn't get anything here though so it was time to leave for the day all right y'all so there you guys have it we went to like five or six different stores today and honestly a lot of them were hit or miss but marshall's was super cool because i've never seen those squish ever before and there were valentine's and easter which is very interesting but let me know if you guys have seen those squish before because i haven't and then seeing that new squad at my kroger affiliate was super cool that neapolitan ice cream sandwich was definitely super tempting and let me know if y'all have ever heard of a special edition squish before because i haven't that being said though that is it for today's video so until the next video we'll see you in the next one bye